South Asia is prone to natural disasters such as floods, droughts, and cyclones. Over 750 million people in South Asia are vulnerable to natural disasters. Sri Lanka is one such country with high vulnerability to climate change. Projected changes are expected to impact the country's poorest and the most marginalized communities, increasing poverty and inequality. Smallholder farmers are amongst the most vulnerable to climate shocks. All these farmers are landless, marginal farmers who are exposed to climate shock. And what we are trying to do here is bundling insurance with seeds and climate information services. So through this project, IMI built the first satellite-based weather index insurance product in Anuradhapura district. And the scope of this particular product is how weather risk can be managed through satellite technology. Recently, around 100 farmers in the north-central province of Sri Lanka received insurance payouts for excess rainfall that caused crop damage in the previous season. The payouts come via an initiative from the International Water Management Institute that seeks to build resilience for farmers through climate risk insurance. Apitam me raksana kaya nako rektor minister tulu biak upadi nama, eki ane raksane samahari tapi mudal yoda bala raksane karan nona. Hemotam me sahane aklaba aja nini sa me raksana awar ne apitam wasi akwe kela goi mahatung hati ata me apit visa asakar nona. This IM initiative provides bundle solutions comprising of four components: index insurance, climate resilient seeds, agro advice, and climatic advice. This will help Sri Lankan farmers navigate the climate crisis while boosting agricultural production and income. In the climate information services, is we look at what's the likely weather is going to happen in the next couple of days, and how the advisories like uh, pest and management diseases can be addressed better much well in advance with a lead time of 10 days so the farmers can take some specific pesticides that can be applied. Look at this particular picture here, the maize is completely affected by armyworm disease. So if we provide timely inputs to the farmers, they could apply a specific fertilizers and the pesticides, they could able to manage if not completely the entire damage that will happen due to this armyworm. I think we have to take a look at it and we have to take a look at it. We have to take a look at it and we have to take a look at it. We have to take a look at it and we have to take a look at it. We have to take a look at it and we have to take a look at it and we have to take a look at it. We have to take a look at it and we have to take a look at it. We have to take a look at it and we have to take a look at it. We have to take a look at it and we have to take a look at it. Pesta ni tu, hari ni kalau macam tu insurance yang ni, hindi itu yang orang kerana goi tanah api dia kredit pura tama insurance yang tekka balap pura tu yang ada ini. Ni yang kahli sambang tu api, entar macam goi mahatung hati tapi tu mahaluk wad dekim ni. Ni yang ke ini, paya ini, warsa pertanian yang ini kehilan dana ni. Namut me SMS seka hara ha, api tu dengan biji situ ini macam tu dengan kahli lebih lati ni. Nama pohora dana mana dengan awasnya kahli. So IMI built this uh, bundling solution where technologies can be better improved and enhance better resilience among in a holistic approach. So this is a overall a risk management approach I would call. And we are looking to scale this product in other intermediate and dry zones in Sri Lanka including Ampara, Amantota, Kurnaigala, Anuradhapura districts and also the Wavinia.